going on? I hope you all are having a dope ass day. It's your boy Alex and I am back today with another reaction video. My back hurts, but I don't really know why. And yesterday was a crazy ass day because as you know, well some of y'all know, so some of y'all checked out the Ramstein video and some of y'all didn't. I tried to upload it three separate times, tried to cut it and edit it all sorts of ways trying to get around the copyright. Uploaded it three times, it got copyrighted every time. <laughs> set up a Google Drive link, and it turns out that too many people have watched it because y'all love my content. So it wasn't a bulletproof plan, but you know, it worked kind of. So I tried my best, guys. I'm sorry for those y'all who didn't get to watch it. Suck a dick. That being said, let's move on to today because we are going to be reacting to Parkway Drive. A, they are an Australian metalcore group, and I am more than excited to see it because I have seen this so many times in the comments. So let's see what it's all about. With a little bit of research beforehand, I found out that the group was from Byron Bay, New South Wales, and I also found out that the song that we are going to be reacting to today called Dark Days is about like environmental conscientiousness. Um, pretty much a song about the environment. So that's all I want to say. Let's dive right into it. Link to the original video will be down below in the description. Y'all make sure to check it out if you want to. And yeah, man, let's see what this is all about. Yeah. Okay, so right off jump, they are coming in with some energy, bro. And without having the lyrics pulled up, I would have no idea what the song is talking about. The lyrics are, what will you tell your children when they ask you what went wrong? How can you paint a picture of a paradise lost to eyes that know only a wasteland? How will you justify watching the world die? Pretty much saying, what are you going to tell your children whenever you have to say that this beautiful place called Earth is just deteriorating because we are too stupid to maintain Earth's beauty? What are you going to say? Point being, without the lyrics, it'd be very hard for me to understand this, but I love this because it's so energetic and so hype and I don't mind the screaming actually. Okay, also, sorry, I don't mean to pause it this much. The visuals for this video are really, really cool. Really well done. Shows a lot of the environment and shows a lot of the pollution of the environment. So it's obviously portraying the message it's trying to deliver to us. Also, the, the lyrics in the bridge saying, Behold the pale horse, this is the funeral of earth. Behold the pale horse, this is the funeral. In the book of Revelations, the four horsemen, the very last one, death, was, be, was riding on a pale horse. So I think that that was the allusion to this. But these lyrics are deep, bro. Talking about some real sh** which I love. Can no longer be cast. Your clock is ticking. There is no second chance. The blind eye can no longer be cast. We'll build a new song if we can break the chains. The clock is ticking. There is no second chance. We'll build a new song if we can break. I'm feeling like my musical taste has definitely changed. If I started off reacting to this video and I had never listened to metal like before the very first Slipknot video, I don't think that I would particularly like this song. But now in the place I am and as much metal as I've listened to, I really, really like this, dude. This is awesome. If we can't run the 
That's so hard. This is actually eye-opening because the earth is such a beautiful place and humans are just doing so much to destroy it. It's such a hype and intense song and like a emotional and passionate song, but it's a passionate topic. So the way that he's screaming and the intensity of it mirrors the message of the song. So I think that the tone of the song really matches the message. I just think that that's awesome. Wow. Okay, so this was cool. Something I just now noticed is there's a lot of intensity in the song that like I just said, but there's also a lot of slow motion shots. So in my mind, that mirrors what happens in our environment. The change and the destruction we're doing to Earth is a very slow and gradual process, mirrored by the slow motion of this. But at the same time, this, they're doing slow motions of something so intense, like they're getting super hype, but it's slow motions of them getting hype. So in my mind, that's like, it's a slow deterioration, but the deterioration of Earth is such an intense issue that the song just mirrors perfectly with the issue it's trying to describe. I've given my analysis of the song throughout, so I don't have much to say now. That's where you guys come in. Drop some comments down below. Let me know what you think of the video, the song, the group, anything you want to talk about. I will! This was dope as hell. I really, really f*** with Parkway Drive, and y'all been telling me I was going to. So it's not that I didn't trust you, it's that I have so many suggestions to work through, but I finally got to it. Drop some comments down below and let me know some more Parkway Drive to react to because this was dope. That's all I got for you today, so keep smiling, keep being yourself, don't let anybody throw shade at you, and I will see you tomorrow. That's a motherfucking <laughs> fact, though! Peace! <laughs> The blind eye and the world can be cast